Hello, this is Steve Grisetti, co-founder of MoviePix.com and author of the MoviePix.com guide to Adobe Photoshop Elements. And here we are in Photoshop Elements 2021 looking at some of the new features. One new feature that you may miss, because it's kind of tucked away here, but is actually pretty advanced, is something Adobe is calling the quote graphic creator. And you can find it under the create button here in the upper right hand corner. There's our quote graphic. Now quote graphics begin with a library here of basic templates. And of course these can all be modified or you can start from scratch and build your own. But let's go ahead and select one that's pre-made. And then there are a number of template shapes for you, depending on whether you're going to use these in Instagram as a Facebook post or as a Facebook cover, Twitter, Pinterest. Let's go ahead and select Facebook post. Click OK. Now there are a number of elements here and they can all be modified. So if I don't like this background, I can simply select from the backgrounds on display here. Simple double click adds them. You can of course select any photo on your computer and use that as your background. As you'd expect, you can double click on the text and you can modify the text too. And you can reshape the box. You can reposition the box. And of course, with the text selected, you can modify its font, you can modify its color, whatever you'd like to do. You go up here to the Shapes tab. You can add new shapes or new graphics to your quote graphic. And if you go over here to the Graphics category, there's even a larger library of graphics to add to your quote graphic. You just double click on them to add them. If you go down here to the bottom of this column, there are even more options to modify this quote graphic. We've done background, we've done text. We can change style, which means you can choose a different template if you prefer. And then there's even an animation button. Click on that and there's some preset animations. Some that animate the text, like this one if I double click on it, move your text around. And some, if I go down here a little farther, animate the text as well as the background. Pretty cool, huh? Once you're happy with the results, click the Save button, and you can save it as an animated GIF, and then you can upload that animated GIF to any social media site or any website at all, and it will play on anybody's browser as a continuous repeating GIF. Pretty cool. One of the new tools here in Photoshop Elements 2021. Now, if you want to know more about all the tools, the new and the old tools here in Photoshop Elements, you want to check out my MoviePix.com guide to Adobe Photoshop Elements and the MoviePix.com guide to Premiere Elements. They're both available at Amazon.com. I'm Steve Grisetti. Hope to see you again soon.